All right, so this is a Smith & Wesson Chief Special and Pearl Grips? Ivory. Ivory Grips, okay. Ooh. So, yeah, those would be criminal or something, I think, in some states now, just to own them. Um, we can still own Ivory because, well, I don't know. No, we can't either. Oh, no, we can't either? Well, we can't get new stuff, right? We can't get new stuff. Either. Yeah. So that's a beautiful little gun as well. Uh, that is a checkered history, believe me. Is that hammer know. bobbed? Eh? Is that hammer bobbed on that thing? The hammer's been bobbed. It came with a left-handed shoulder holster. And a doctor owned it. Ah, That's really? about as far as I know about that gun. A doctor? A doc local doctor. That's kind of cool. And he had a shoulder holster for it. Yeah. That's even cooler. Yeah. <laughs> so people did carry guns in Canada at one time. We're not ever sure with this guy. <laughs> that is a very nice piece. So it is. It is an extremely nice piece. Fumbly, fumbly. Let me get that thing open. For Thank you. Yeah, unfortunately, my hand is not working right. So my hand is sticky to it. Yeah, well, whatever. She made you work close. <laughs> you can just wipe them all off again. I will. <laughs> <laughs> so. As you can see, pearl grips. Oh, that ivory. is ivory grips. Sorry, ivory grips. It's pearl not grips. a pimp gun. Yeah, it's a doctor's gun. That's a beautiful piece. Now, is that slated to be destroyed? It absolutely short, too short a barrel. Okay, so next one we're gonna look at. Hang on. 